Hey everybody, Jay here. Welcome back to the homestead. Early chilly day here in October. Wow. Um, we're starting the wood up soon, obviously. Um, <laughs> you can, I'm sure you can imagine that'd be coming. Anyways, today, real quick, on the homestead, we're going to calculate um, how quickly we can produce firewood and at what cost. So as you can see, we have this mound of firewood behind us here. Um, now we already know, let's backtrack a little bit. We already know it takes an hour to load, deliver, and return here on the homestead when we have the wood already stacked in pre-measured cords. It takes one hour to make one trip. So we already know that, so that's the one third of it. The second part of it is going to be processing time. How long does it take to actually produce and split a cord of wood? And then obviously the first time would be actually getting the wood either A, out of the woods or from a tree drop or whatever it may be. So we're gonna focus on the middle part here as far as processing time. We're gonna calculate how quickly we can produce uh, probably a face cord. We're gonna run the timer until we produce a face cord and then obviously we can times that by three. Obviously we're gonna calculate how much fuel we use too. So today we're gonna figure out a few things as far as firewood and our costs of production. All right, so this is a four by four by eight uh, wood rack. Uh, as you guys know, we have a seasoned one there. We have our cherry one over there. We have this massive, massive pile of maple from that most recent job we did. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna finish that back face cord there, which will be one third of a cord. And then you and I are gonna time how long it takes to produce the middle row there, which would be another face cord. So yeah, we'll set you guys up on time lapse, do a few different angles. We're gonna fill our county line 20, was it 25 ton? Yeah, 25 ton log splitter completely up to the top of fuel. And we're gonna see time and fuel it takes to produce one face cord of wood from this wood here.
All right, folks. Well, I think we did it. What time is it here? It is now 7.53 and we started at 7.10. So we'll call it 40, 45 minutes because I spent a little time obviously setting up the cameras. In 45 minutes, we produced a face cord of wood. That's pretty, that's pretty I good. I forgot our uh, fuel usage. So we filled up, this is a 32 ounce can. This is what we had kicking around. This is just to measure. So there's 32 ounces of fuel in this can here. So and we filled this right to the top. Uh, that almost worked out literally perfect. Yep. So we used in 45 minutes of running the splitter, we used one quart or 32 ounces of fuel. Where does it say? Seeing is believing. 32 ounces of fuel for 45 minutes running the county line. That's not bad at all. All right, folks. Well, there you have it. Our start time was 7:10. It is. Uh, what time is it now? It is 7:55. So in 7:10 to 55. In call it four, we'll call it 45 minutes because I spent some time obviously setting up the camera and adjusting that. So in 45 minutes, we produced a face cord of wood. Now we got to put those top boards back on and then we have some slivers here. We'll slide in the top, but this is 16 inch firewood, eight feet long, four feet tall. So that is one face cord. So we did one face cord in 45 minutes. I don't know about you, but that's a pretty decent, um, production rate so 45 minutes I produce a face cord which here in New Hampshire a cord of wood sells for 325 um, so I would definitely say we'll call it $110 in 45 minutes so that's not bad at all now that's obviously having the wood stacked and decked as you can see here we made a little dent out of the pile here but we still have um, plenty to go in this here pile um, this is maple from the tree job we actually have to go back and get the stump uh, that's all we have left there, but I'll show you that uh, in another day. But yeah, needless to say, we made a fair dent. I would imagine the rest of this maple would easily fill uh, another face court, and then we have to rearrange our racks over there to make life easier, and we will be continuing to process wood. We still have about one full cord there of seasoned, ready to go wood um, that we held on to. That's gonna, we'll sell that to Josh or his father in law if they need it late season. We could deliver that uh, in the heavy Chevy. But needless to say, folks. 45 minutes, we produce the face cord, which is about $110 of wood here in New Hampshire. So thanks for sticking along. Uh, I'm gonna clean up here because I'm up before the kids. So the kids are getting up soon. So uh, yeah, we're gonna, this concludes our broadcast here. So thanks for watching guys. Let me know what you think. Um, that's pretty good for the county line. It's not the most professional log splitter by any stretch of the imagination. It doesn't have a log lift and doesn't have a four or six way wedge, but a face cord in 45 minutes for what I do I'm happy with that. So three hours for a cord of wood, uh, which is $325. So still, that's $110 an hour just for, you know, if the wood was here magically for free. So yeah, just we'll calculate the whole thing when we get there. But thanks for watching, guys. Let me know what you think. God bless. And like I always say, we will see you guys out in the woods.